Hello out there and welcome to English Teacher Plays. We're here with Booth, which is a new game. It's on Steam and uh, full disclosure, I did receive my copy for free. So we're gonna, we're gonna get in, we're gonna play it. Memory one empty. We're gonna play memory one, I guess. It's got this sort of like uh, retro future aesthetic. Oh, what is this? Blessed. There'll be less punishment from the gameplay to assure you a smoother story experience. Braving, show me life as it is. Sure. Let's go with life as it is. Braving. We are braving! Dun ba ba ba! Bum 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 ba ba ba! My progress will be saved automatically at the end of game day. Do not exit the game when the sign below is showing. Righty -o. I'm ready to rock! Let's play Booth! I don't know anything about it. Oh, it's very dark. Year 2036 says the environment on Earth continues to deteriorate. Untainted food sources have become extremely difficult to find. Got some dark stuff going on on the right. Most borders are closed for security reasons. And the government of each country begins to take charge of the acquisition and distribution of food for its people. Every piece of food that goes into the country must pass a variety of examinations executed by uh, the government-employed food inspectors. Right. So, we are going to be government, in food, government food inspectors um, in the same vein as Papers, Please. You know, like where we were checking people through the thing. So, this is like a retro future thing. Ooh, prologue. Booth. Ooh. Love that music. And then it stopped. And so we don't have it anymore. So I don't know what we're doing. Looks like a butt. Oh. A night with heavy rain. Tenement C6, uh, C501, District 8, Iden City. Okay. Do I have to click? Here. Tuck yourself in. Who are we talking to? Like a child, maybe. There you go. Daddy? What's the story tonight? Ah, you've been waiting, haven't you? Of course! Of course I've been waiting. Hmm. Well, well. I have a good one for you today. It happened in a place far west. I mean, real far. And it's about a man and a sea turtle. Nice. Sea turtles are rad. Plus, there's a dragon. Oh, no, there's a princess living under the sea. Okay. Wow, go on. Go on. Hold on, little man. All right, remember what I told you about these stories. Uh, never share them with anyone else. That's a bit dark. That's right. We're already seeing some cracks. You've just earned yourself another story. Yeah! dun dun dun, -dun. Uh-oh, secret police are here. Daddy, who are they? It's okay, son. Just some friends from work. Good evening, Mr. Crawford. Sorry to bother you this late. What's up? Please come with us to the office. No. Okay, who's looking after the little kid? Daddy? Where are you going? To the office, man. Didn't you hear him? Right. So they've just... They, they called their shot. This is not going to be a light and fluffy story. This is going to be quite dark. Fifteen years later. So we're the kid. And our dad got murdered by the Gestapo or whatever. July 20th, 2036. Meeting room A13, Iden Central Government, Iden City. Whew. Excuse me, I'm a little bit tired today. That'd be all for the interview, thank you. Alright, just some last things to confirm. Please, yes, please. Don't be so uptight, son. The interview's over. Oh, I, uh, sorry. Now look at the screen there. Yeah, I can see it. Right? The place you'll be working at is a booth like this. About 3,000 feet above the sea, well integrated with the food line, and 30 minutes airship ride from the city. Cool! You'll be living, not just working at the booth, for at least six months straight before you can take a leave. Alright. Safe and healthy food is available for you during the course of employment, and your families down here will be granted priority in food matters. 
Excellent. You'll be paid each day on how well you've done your job that day. Fair and square. Righty-ho. That makes sense. Are we clear on all these? Yeah. What's up? Let me know the result in a couple of days. Cool. What's going on? At the same time... Ooh. Oh, I have a case of the Yawnies. About 3,000 feet above the sea, one of the booths, Iden's skyline area. Right. What is... Ooh. So we can click on all this stuff. Books I've read too many times. Feel sick just looking at the covers now. A music tape player that cost me a fortune. My dearest Eve. I don't know if these tapes. What's that? Two supreme leaders of the great ones. A sage and a warrior. That's what people say. Ticket to see Eve costs 2500 My saving is 250 It's the ministry of answer on radio now. Not interested. Empty beer cans. We flicked on all the things, I think. Uh, yes, I guess. I guess we go to bed. I don't see what else we could have done. What? Wait, everything has a weight. Say, health and wealth. What do you think? Try using the scale in front of you to find out. That's right. See? Everything has a weight. Okay, now give me the heavier one. I'm hungry. Okay. This one. Thank you. Wait, my brother's got something to say. Why is there a giant whale thing talking to me? That's so weird. Color. Everything has a color. Not the shell, but the core. Say, the first kiss of a girl and the last night before a wedding. Right? You aren't so surprised. Why not try it out yourself? With the tester there. See if it's the same as you think. Uh. So. Okay. Okay. Good guess. Now give me the purple one. I'm hungry. Sure. Alright. Like my brother said, you seem like a good person. May the rules of world guide your way. Okay, this is super weird. Why was there a weird whale thing? That was just so odd. Approved. I've been approved! Yes! Get in there! My application was approved. All right, I'm ready to. I'm ready to um, do some food stuff. Skyline booth 105. Work hours are 12 midnight to 8 a.m. That's weird work hours, but that's fine. Na National food Idensky. <laughs> uh, get ready to leave for the booth tonight. July 30th. Inside an airship, Iden Industrial Bay. Cool, let's go. We're off. We're papers pleasing, but... Alright, next stop, booth 103. Oh, here's a dude. We'll check the list for the last time. Booth 103. Here. Booth 105, Ned Crawford. That's me. And booth 220, Awan Halim. Here. Good, looks like we got everyone. This is the last patch. We had much more last year, didn't we? Last year, many new booths were built, so they expanded the enrollments as well. Oh, rude! That's so rude! We've got plenty of applicants for replacement. You've all gone through a lot to get here. I hope you can all live up to our expectation. Today, you may be proud of being an inspector. May tomorrow the inspectors be proud of having you. Right, let's go. Welcome to the food inspection skyline. Cool. Now fasten your seatbelt. Alright. Hey buddy, you holding up? Uh... Yeah, that's the spirit. You look a lot calmer than me. I used to work in the food inspection landline, so not a novice. So I got a clue to something. Alright. Oh, and why'd you come here then? 
Uh, could you do me a favor? What favor? Can't be too specific right now, but you can expect a phone call at least a couple of days. Uh, okay, that's weird. Can't promise you about the favor. A breeze? Oh, take this. You'll probably need it someday. Whatever that is. We're about to take off. Alright. Uh, it's gonna be a long night ahead. Right, so it is, it is papers pleasy, um, you know, it's putting you into moral quandaries about, uh, your decision making. 11.05 p.m. I'm excited, I'm excited. This is cool. I really like this. Yeah, here we go. And we're off in our airship. I wish I could click around at stuff while this was going on, but that's fine. That's fine that I can't. It's a bit loud. Oh, we're here then, Mr. Crawford. Booth 105, your new home. Thanks, man. Peace out. Mind the gap when you get off. Oh, he's going to give me a tour. Show me all about the place. Three designated restaurants. Takeout cards. Due to the traffic and energy control, every worker can only order from one restaurant each day. Work will get in front of the belt when you're ready. Looking forward to your excellent debut. Okay. Fuquang, fast, healthy, and yummy. Right. I don't know what that is. ID card, all right. We can go this way. What's that? I don't know what that is. What is that? Oh, it's a phone, phone thing, all right. We've got a canned fish. Quadruped milk. Right. What's this? No. We got a scale. Oh, this is the thing. Right. Oh, we're at 89 health. All right, this. What is this? And three-year-old me, the face of my dad has been speared under... I was told it's, a la it's shot in the last photo studio in Iden before it got shut down permanently. Right. No, I don't want to use that. Hold left click to drink. So I don't know. So what are we supposed to do here? How do we get? How do we get started? Um. So I'm just tapping on stuff. Right. Now how do I turn that off? Let's go somewhere else. Guess I should order takeout before work. Okay. Oh, I see. I need to go use the phone. Right. So they gave me they gave me a little hint. All right. Where's my phone again? All right. Here we go. So what was it? Fast, healthy, and yummy. Bento sushi. Um. Seven one seven five five seven seven. Seven one seven five five seven seven. How do I? Oh. 7175577. How do I call? 7175577. Oh, it's here. There we go. Hello, Zendesu. May I take your order? Uh, sure. Let's get... Yes, I would love a sushi set. Alright. Okay, we'll do it right away, right after your work hours. Cool. I don't actually know what I'm supposed to be doing. Oh, is our... Is the thing running now? Work. Time to work. Uh, right. We have two new co-workers. So let me int briefly introduce today's task. Uh, we've got two products to check today. Every t item must pass the weight test and the color test. Yellow, 305 to 335, and blue, 495 to 505, right? See, yeah, I see it on the screen. The first line shows the correct result of the color test. All right. 
And the second line shows the correct interval of the weight test. Right. Should weigh within that range, endpoints included. Got it. Dump them into, into the recycle hole on the right side. One if you see any products that are not on the screen, you must hit the red button on the left side to report. I'll tell you what to do with them next. That's all. Let's get to work. All right, we're working. So 498, sure. And then it's blue. All right, so that can go. 327. Yeah. And we'll see if it's yellow or not. It is. Cool. So we're doing it. We're doing a uh, soul crushing factory job. Good job, us. Yellow. Sweet. Alright. 328 is fine. This is weird that we're... This is a weird thing that we're testing. Um, now give me that. Alright. 495 to 505. Wah. Wrong. 499. Nice. It's gotta be blue. It is. It can go. We're doing well. We are winning the game. 505. Inclusive. Yeah, I remember. Yeah, cool. I wonder if it speeds up. 319. Yep, that's fine. Yellow, that's great. Huh, <sighs> yeah. Man, this is pretty grindy. Yep, it's yellow. Cool. We've had to throw one of them out so far, but I guess that's what you'd want, right? 500's fine. Man, is this a, a way to see how long people will, like, stay in the game doing this? 334, yeah. Uh, I'll fast forward till we get to... Oh, we found an unqualified item. Wait, what? It was not unqualified. Blue. That's so rude. 306. I don't know what my unqualified item was, though. I'm finished! I don't have any delayed items. Stop delay stop taking away my my pay. NFSA, what does that mean? At right, one Okay. Tired and hungry. What does that mean? How do I How do I answer the door? Your takeout is here. Oh, hi. I'm new delivery part-time at Zen. Nice to meet you. Oh, cool. My hands are all so hasty, but I'm hanging in there. So hanging in there is good? Good. Uh, right, this is cool. Uh, Barai Mashita. Barai Mish Yeah, whatever. Sorry. I'm no local people, so I don't speak good Waitarian. No need to apologize at all. How long have you been learning? One month almost. I want to improve, so I do this part-time. That is really good for a month's progress. Uh, by the way, how should I uh, call you? Uh, yes, I do want to know your name. I'm Iori. Cool. Not Lori. Yori. Iori. Cool. What about you? Ned. Ned Crawford. Nice to meet you, Mr. Crawford. This game is rad. Uh... See you next time. Cool. We probably needed more takeout than that. That's fine. So we can go to bed. We're done working for the day. Sure. I'm having a headache. Probably it's... Uh... But now I just want a good sleep. All right, let's go. Let's go to sleep. Let's see what happens on day two. Chapter one. Good day. Goodbye. That's ominous. So we played through the prologue. What is chapter chapter one gonna look like? Oh. 
Uh, is that my alarm? It may take some time before I can get used to the night shift, but arrest did bring feelings back to me. Yes, it's really happening, and there's no turning back. My escape from Iden turn uh, starts today. What? What is that? Dear, welcome to the live. Le welcome to live in booth 105. May you have a good stay. Apparently, these people never e economize their dis. Oh. General clues include all clues that are not. Hover through the clue labels to see their details. All right. Okay. What is this guy? Skyline food. To be an excellent line food inspector. Don't know anymore or if it's even true. Uh, she's from Iden. She says she's learning Wyatarian. Okay, cool. A passable sleep. Getting up at night to work. Uh, better order some food first. Um, sure. I can do that. I think it, is it this one? Uh, no. Oh, it, it, oh my god. Who's at my door? Uh, hello? Nice to meet you. I'm Nastia, in charge of the shopping service. Oh, I just got up here yesterday. I know who you are, not that many new faces in Skyline this year. How's your first day? I... I guess I like living in the booth. Yeah. Do you miss home? Uh, no thanks for asking, though. It's just our job to check on your mental health from time to time. What do you want to order today? Wait, what? Uh, ask about this. Is this service free? Oh, of course. Okay. There's no reason to charge it. And things on the catalog are fixed or will be up. Okay. We have to control the transportation costs. It will only have up to six items in the catalog each time. Okay, that's cool. Alright, let's see the catalog, I guess. Welfare lottery? <laughs> I can get a poster. I can get some beer. What is this? Uh, I can get a manga. Songs for my funeral. <laughs> oh my goodness. Yeah, let's get that. Um, let's buy this manga. Sure. There we go. Alright, I'll bring them to you next time we meet. Cool. Alright, so now I want to order some sushi. Seven, one, seven, five, five, seven, seven. There we go. This is cool, man. Um, let's buy something a little bit more filling this time. Yes. All right. Thank you. All right. Now let's go to work. We'll do. We'll do another day of work. Yep. There's one thing for in the newcomers yesterday. Working is. You'll see. You get one of the best perks available in town. Have a look at the drawer under your work table. That's right. You get to listen to the best music in Iden for free. Too many six will send you home. Uh. Sure. Hey. Uh, oh my god. Blue. Yeah. Five oh seven goes in the dump. Yeah. Five oh five's fine. It's blue. Yeah, this one needs to be. 295. No, nope, it's bad. Man, this music's weird. This music's real weird. Yeah, that's fine. Yellow. Yeah, get in there. And here. Okay, so I'm going to fast forward through this bet. So I did really, really, really poorly. 
Like, extremely poorly. Hey, morning! Today is also hanging in there? Ah, uh, yes. <laughs> By the way, Yori, I'm just wondering how did you come to Aiden? You know, with all the borders closed. Hmm, borders closed? Sorry, I don't understand. <laughs> hmm, before Aiden. Oh, I see. You know Tuland? Tuland. No, I don't. Yes, it's really bad now. Because of that, I'm here. Great! Okay, what exactly do you mean bad? Hmm, I, I don't know how to say it. Right. Sorry, I need to learn hard. Uh, alright. Go to the delivery. Thanks, man. See you later. Peace. Right, we did really poorly on our, uh, on our stuff. We'll eat that. That will help us out. Is there anything out here to click on? Um, oh, we're at, oh my god, the phone's ringing. Where's the phone? Hi, here's Jack from Yorozuya. Yep, what's up? We received your payment yesterday. A, a lady at Iden Care Center will be looked after at regular intervals over the course of the next 15 years. Is that correct? Yes. Great. I'll be in direct contact with you and report to you her status or any emergencies. Okay, thanks, man. And please recommend us to your friends and families if you find our service satisfying. Peace out, I guess. Okay, so let's go look at the description. This game is awesome. I love it. All right, Booth. The year is 2036. In this famine-riddled world, food-centric sovereignty has been established. Living alone inside a food inspection booth, you are striving to find truth and peace beyond the borderline. Uh, developed by Guanping Chen, um, and it's coming out in one hour. It'll be out in one hour, so I don't know how much it's going to cost, but it's very, very, very cool. A retro future dystopian adventure. In the early 21st century, as the environment on Earth continues to deteriorate. Yeah, we already know all this stuff. Um, let's see. Challenge a series of food inspection missions that will put your skills and strategies to the test. Live a solitary life in a booth and spend hard-earned wages on post-cultural gems or lottery tickets. Enjoy an atmospheric and characteristic soundtrack that is exclusive to high-class Aiden citizens. Meet with a dozen or dull or interesting people who may be a help, a threat, or something else to you. Experience an immersive, carefully crafted, branching story where you get to choose sometimes. Mouse is strongly recommended to play Booth. It is very, very, very cool. I love it. I love all of the things about it. Um, like I said, it's definitely got that Papers, Please look. It's got the Papers, Please gameplay. But it's got a little bit more of the story. Papers, Please was definitely really focused on the, um, you know, looking at passports and doing things. And it had the story going on in the background. This was much more focused on the story. You know, it was like I was already in it on day one. I was like, here's some stuff, here's some stuff, here's some stuff, here's some stuff. Um, it's got the clues. It's got, oh man, it's got all sorts of stuff going on for it. So it's very cool. Let's look at Guam Peng Shen. Um, sorry if I just turned on the game. So you get the soundtrack and the game. It's very, very, very cool. So uh, I would highly recommend you check this out. If you played Papers, Please and you liked it, um, this game is going to be right up your alley. You're going to love it. And uh, I'm definitely going to be playing some more of it. It is very dark, very dystopian, definitely my jam. And uh, I hope you guys enjoyed watching that, uh, you know, the opening day uh, and prologue of the game. So thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. Uh, leave me a comment down below. Check out this game. And I will see you guys next time. Class dismissed.